Hello everybody. This is my Easter baskets for um, my nieces and nephews and my daycare kids that I used to watch. Um, they're a little bit crazy and I don't have my tripod to, um, I can't find it. So I'm just going to have to hold my phone while I film this. Um, people may come in and out of the house. Uh, my husband and my brother are outside working on my, um, coupon room table. And there's other people in the house and then the cat. Um, anyway, so, disclaimer, a lot of this stuff I bought way before, um, covid put us all stuck in the house. Um, I've only been to the store once for any Easter stuff and I didn't buy that much. And I ordered Crayola stuff online from their website once. Everything else I bought way before this happened or, and I've also like kept it in my stockpile room and any good deals I kind of just save and save like some of the stuff is from last year when I when we went to music makers and I bought a lot of extra stuff some of it's like clearance from last summer that I got at, like 75 to 90 percent off and so I've just thrown a lot of stuff in their Easter baskets um, some of it's clearance from last Easter just crazy amount of stuff um, I decided that the girls I was gonna do their baskets frozen too and well, there's three girls and then for the my nephew I did Toy Story 4 and then I added a lot of stuff that I had you know okay so I'm gonna do like a reverse Easter basket thing this is kind of how they're all gonna look um, it's kind of crazy trying to shove a lot of stuff in there so I'll start here we had like a Target deal a long time ago for dog treats, and so I got the little one for my sister-in-law's dog. Um, these are just her wife's that I shoved over here, so I could remember to take them. Um, I got these for like super cheap last um, Easter, so I threw those in with these so that the kids could color them. This one's actually already like ripped a little. Yeah, I didn't put it in a very safe place apparently. Um, this is from the dollar spot. I had plans to uh, make some, um, what are they called? Um, I had plans to make some sensory boxes and I didn't get around to it. But my sister-in-law has some sensory boxes at her house so I threw those in. And I found this on clearance for $11, and it's the uh, Frozen 2 Seeing Elsa. And the girls really wanted that, so I wanted to get the Anna one too, but that one wasn't on clearance. Okay, so for um, clearance Frozen stuff, I found it at Walmart a while back, or Michael's had a crazy amount of clearance Frozen stuff at 50% off, um, and then it went 60% off, but then we all got locked up and they had to close the store, but I was able to get a few things, so I got this Pez, um, this, I really like these, um, it's like a fan, and then it has all the lights, I think the kids will like that. It's called Fanimation Animated LED Show and there's candy inside. Which when I bought this I didn't realize but there's candy in here. That's sealed. Um, this I found at Walmart for five bucks on clearance. I could only find one of them though so the younger one gets that one. Um, this was Target Dollar Spot for a dollar. 
these I got for like, I have a video from these, I still have a ton of them, but they were like 25 cents or something crazy. So I threw that. This was like a Valentine clearance and it was super cheap, it was already opened, but I think the kids will still like it and it's been quarantined for quite a while, so it shouldn't have any terms on it. Um, this is Valentine's candy clearance. So this is like 50 cents. And I checked the dates and these last for like a year. So I grabbed it. And then I don't know where I got this. I just threw it in there though. From a long time ago. This is more Michael's clearance. I thought the kids would have fun doing that. The girls. Um, grabbed a little coloring book from the dollar section. It has um, 50 sheets of coloring fun and then 50 blank sides. This was from a long time ago. Um, I found this uh, sunblock. I threw it in there. I have a ton of these. But they were $3. And then, I don't know. And then I got $2 back on Checkout 51 and $2 back on I bought it and two dollars back on swag books, so I got those a money maker. Have a bunch of them. These were obviously the free kits. Then got ten dollars back on I bought it, but my niece loves mushrooms. Like, if you don't give her the pizza with the mushrooms on them, she'll freak out. And so I thought this might be a fun activity for her. Got some frozen lip gloss. Um, this was from Easter a long or a couple years ago um got it super cheap so it's easter theme spot it and then some play-dohs that i got a long time ago and then of course we got chalk and bubbles and this was um 50 off at big lots so this was like 50 cents i think and i couldn't resist dr seuss in the um dollar spot. I think it's three dollars for a book of eight, so eight of these books. So I grabbed that. This was a dollar section find. Um, so I threw that in there from when I had daycare kids. I'd pick up random stuff like that because I just can't resist. Um, this was from Michaels. I got it, I think 40% off is their coupons. And so it's 40% off of that. It was like two something. Anyway, that's what it looks like. And she's in preschool. Um, she is four now. Anyway. Um, yeah. Super cute. Thought she could use that. And then this was also a Valentine clearance. And you can't really tell. Still in Scandy Bar Rainbow to go. So this was like $2. And it has um, just the hard candies and some suckers in there. And she loves suckers. So threw that into hers. And today is actually July 2020. So I thought that would be perfect for Easter. Um, this was like Christmas dollar spot. I have a ton of these. So I threw one of those in there. The kids love them. And at the bottom I just have some dollar tree. Uh, I don't know when I got these, but I had them stashed. So I found the sprinkle art on the Crayola website. I think I had like a free shipping and like a 10 off 40 or something crazy. Plus I had a 10% off Crayola Wonder on their site. So I made these like $4 for each different Crayola set that I got. So I didn't think that was too terrible. And I thought this would be like a fun adult help kind of activity. I just like to listen to the sprinkles though. And then I found the color and sticker Frozen 2 books. So there's stickers and the coloring pages. Oh my goodness. And that's what it looks like. And then I got the Frozen 2 um, Color Wonder Mist Free Coloring. 
They love those. And then at Target, I found this surprise play pack grab and go. It's the bigger one, so it was three dollars. It's by the Benden Company. Um, comes with one surprise foam character, two sticker sheets, one stencil, one velvet poster, eight crayons, 32 page full size coloring book. So that is all the stuff that I have that shows in the Easter basket. The next one, oh, I guess I should say for all of them, I'm going to put some of these. I got these last year on clearance, but they're confetti eggs and they're real eggs that are colored and then they just took the bottoms off. There's confetti in them. It looks like that. And you just like crack them on people. The kids will have fun with them. Um, but this is for the youngest. She just turned a year old. Um, this is the musical rainbow tea party set. So I got that for her. That was already something I had. Um, I found these at Target a while back. They're Easter ducks. And they're super cute. And these probably aren't going to fit her for a long time, but I had them. And I don't even know what size they are. Size 9. Um, but I thought I'd throw them in there as something to that she could grow into. Then I also had this um, onesie. It says, Daddy's Princess has arrived. And it is in 18 to 24 months. So eventually she'll be able to fit into that. So I threw that in there. There's another um, sunblock. And then these were, and I bought a thing a, lot, a while back, the milk teas. And then these were like a dollar for like 10 of them or something really crazy. And I got these a while back. Keep owning at Fred Meyer. And then I threw this book in here. I got it from when we all did the deal that was um, by cereal and you could submit to get a free book. So I threw that in there. I have quite a few of these. I think it was like a limit of 10 books you could get. And then these, I don't remember where I got them, but the package was opening, so I decided to use them as like the Easter grass. So just put them on the bottom, and that is what she's getting from me for Easter. Again, she is one, so her basket is a little smaller. And this is my um, nephew's. He is six. So these are the things that I got him. It's one of those um, things that I had gotten for um, uh, gosh, why can't I ever think of it? Anyway, I can't think of the name right now, but like this one. So I grabbed two of them. So I put that in there. I got him some edible grass. Um, all these things. I didn't get him the trolls one, so I found this one at Big Lots and it was 50 cents. So I threw that in there. Um, his things are a little different than the girls's, but a lot of the things are the same. So he has this one for that. Um, chalk, because I got these for like 50 cents at Walgreens a long time ago. I still have like 15 more boxes of them. And then these were like super cheap. I grabbed him this Mario bath bomb because he loves Mario. These were Valentine's clearance, but they don't look like Valentine's clearance. And so I threw that in there. And then for his Valentine clearance candy, I found this one for like $2. And it has chocolates, um, little bracelets, there's gum, hard candies. It has the little same stars anyway valentine's clearance like buy ahead guys it really saves you money and time um he also got one of these she got one i don't remember if i showed it but it should have been in there but i think one of them is like vanilla scented oh yeah i did show this and then chocolate and his is strawberry scented um Oh, I don't remember if I showed this and hers, but they each get a little Play-Doh kit. Hers is smaller. 
This is what I could find. Um, but it comes with like a little Play-Doh and like a little thing. It's the Play-Doh Kitchen Creations. His is a bigger set. And his is the um, Burgers and Fries set. So it's super fun. I wanted to get them stuff that they could do in quarantine. That would be fun and creative. Um, and then he also got the color and sticker, but his is Toy Story 4. He also got the Crayola Miss Free one, and that's also Toy Story 4. So that's what it's like. And then... And those. And I wanted to get them all clothing, but because we've been locked up, I haven't had time to find them each a cute clothing thing, but right before we got locked up, I went to the Disney store, and I found this on clearance, and I knew his was going to be on um, Toy Story, so I, it was $5.98, originally it was 13 so I was hoping to find the girls something frozen, but that didn't happen. There's some bubbles in here, some clearance stuff, and then he also got the grab and go but in Toy Story 4, and it's the same thing. It has all the same stuff in it. And then there's the oh the places I'll go, and there's some play-doh in here. And then I found this because the girls had a lot of like frozen stuff that I couldn't find Toy Story 4 wise, so I found this. He does like. Paw Patrol, or you used to at least, and it says this isn't your average bubble. This was Easter, 50% off, um, so it's $2.50 from Big Lots, and I'm not really sure. I guess you just, like, paddle them. Don't let anyone touch your burst your bubble, and no burst bubbles, eight bubble, ball paddle, oh, and bubble wall paddle, hmm. <laughs> trying to read through my phone, it's not working very well. Anyway, you can kill like that. Something to do outdoors. And then found these at the Disney store. And... Oh my goodness. Okay. So this found at the Disney store when we went. It was also on clearance for $5.98. The original price was $16.95. So I thought that was a really good deal. And it is actually a eraser making kit. And this is what it what it looks like. Um, these are all your clays and you put them in here and on the back it kind of shows you. So you like stretch it out, you mold it and you put your pencil in and then you bake it and they turn out like that. So he's six. I thought he would have fun with this. Um, it says eight plus but it'll just be an adult activity. And I have another kit that I found him too while I was at the Disney store. So his are kind of like bigger kits. I don't really do like who has the most and like I try to make them as even as I can but you know I didn't really calculate it. I think they'll all like it anyway. Um, these were $5.98 and clearance. This one was also $16.95 original price. So definitely always look for clearance stuff. It is like the best and this is what you can make out of it. It's build your own arcade shooting gallery and it comes with all the stuff and you actually use the box to make it. It even says upcycled packaging project and this is what it's supposed to be. So I thought that was really fun. He will like that. And then for the last one she is five. Hers is kind of, sorry guys, um, the same as the four-year-old's, but a little bit different. So she also got a bigger Play-Doh kit. I was trying to find them all the $5 one, but there was only one, so these guys got a bigger one. Um, this is the milk and cookie set. comes with like six little things and then Play-Doh things and then all the little stuff. It's kind of cool that it comes out of this little milk jug but that's 
what it looks like. Um, this is a different household, so I actually um, found one of these that I'm going to give them. I believe they can use it. Um, this game is back from Valentine's Day. I was going to give them each a game for Valentine's Day. Oops, scoops. So I'm throwing that in her Easter basket. Um, that's also the Elsa singing doll. She also has the kids, um, sunblock and hers and the trolls. Um, some random things that I found in my bedroom. This was also a dollar spot thing. And she loves paint, so I threw that in there. Um, some more of those. She got the green edible grass. She got more um, chalk stuff than the other kids did. Because originally I wasn't going to put chalk stuff in there. It's because where they live, they're not really supposed to play with chalk. But I ended up throwing them in there anyway. So that if they went somewhere, um, they could play with chalk. So got that. She also has this, this sun catcher. She really loves to paint. Um, I threw this in there because um, the other kids could share the other book. So I threw that one in there for her because it's a different household. She also has some random Play-Doh and random chalk stuff. She also gets this one because that's what I managed to find was the two of these and the one of the other ones. But because the youngest um, probably shouldn't have gum yet, I gave these to the older two. And she actually loves gum. The five-year-old does, so she gets that. There's some colored pencils and stuff. Um, and some markers and some paint for her in there. This was another thing that I had bought with um, plans to do it with this child because I used to babysitter. And we, I think it just got lost and we never did it. And it's $3 from the dollar spot. So I threw that in her. Um, this was another like Easter clearance fund from a long time ago. But it's princesses. So it's perfect. And I threw it in there for her. She also gets one of these bracelets. She also gets a book. Some more chalk. She also gets. One of these lip glosses. They both love the lip glosses and the fan. And then I found this toothbrush from an Ibotta thing, so I threw that in there for her. Some glue sticks, and like I said, she gets more chalk because the original plan wasn't to put chalk in the other ones, but I threw them in there anyway. Otherwise, I would have bought more of those for the other kids too, but there's some more um, other types of chalk. And then she also gets a Pez two and like the other Pez was Olaf and then I also got her one of these and the other one I think was Anna so I kind of switched them for them so it's the same things but a little different I also got this for her she loves to have her nails done that was also 50% off. I had planned to originally get um, a set like this for the other one, the four-year-old, but it didn't get paid for, so I left it at the store. It got, like, hidden under stuff, and I never made it back to get one for her. But she already got one anyway, so it's okay. And then she also got the sprinkle art. This one's a different one than the other one, and I just love the sound of that. And then these are the same. She also got the Color and Sticker Frozen, the Color Wonder Frozen, and then the Frozen 2 Play Pack in hers. And then this is just like a random little Play-Doh thing that I put in there. So that is what... Sorry guys, it's really bad when I have to hold my phone and get my finger in it. Um, that is what I got for them. Now I need to put it back together. Um... Yeah, but I'm just going to do porch drop-off on these, and then I also did get the boys' little somethings, but I don't have theirs together at all, so I probably won't record those. Um, yeah, let me know what you guys think. It is a little overboard, but they are kind of, like, locked up right now, and I miss them. 
and I have all this stuff just sitting around my house because I keep on in clearance shop way too much. But I hope you guys are staying safe and healthy and we'll see you again soon. Maybe when we can get back to keep on. Bye guys.